What's up, HG Nation? Hey, Zach Edwards here with another uh, Game Design Wednesday. Today we're going to be talking about Eleanor Abbott. But before I get there, can I just tell you how tired I am? Holy cow, I've been working on this house for ever. Uh, last week I told you that I can't, just came back from uh, scraping wallpaper. Well, it still continues. I'm doing a lot of the work in there. <clears throat> in the course, we're actually teaching you how to do some of the work. Also, how to get contractors. We have contractors for um, drywall, plumbing, uh, electrical, paint on the exterior. We're actually doing the inside. So all these things are going to be talking about in our um, house flipping uh, course that we're going to be creating. And this is a like a, a year long course, so you actually get a lot of information. We're not the we're going to give you everything that the experts sell sell to you for like thousands of dollars, but we're going to give it to you on your your level. A lot of you guys won't be able to to use it. Some of you, I, I mean, I've seen teenagers as as actually not even teenagers yet, a twelve year old go out and buy his own house and flip it. Yeah, that's right. 12 year olds are flipping their own houses. So if they can do it, you can do it. We're going to teach you how to do it. And we actually have interviews in the course of these people. So you got to check that out. Um, also, we're going to be able to do a lot of other things, but just, you know, I'm really tired. If I seem a little bit down today, not being able to get the excitement up, that's just it. It's not that I'm not excited. I am totally excited to be on here with you guys. I'm just tired. Totally exhausted. Four days. The last four days I've been in there. I even slept on the ground, not in a bed, in order to be out there um, in Kansas next to the house. So anyways, back to the game design course. Okay, so Eleanor Abbott. You ever heard of this lady? Well, this is another name. So this is another name that you probably should have heard about. Eleanor Abbott is the creator of None other than Candyland. Yeah, Candyland. You know the one that you everyone grew up on? Walking through the sugarcane forest. Actually, I don't remember what all the different parts are. Candy cane forest, maybe? One of those. Yeah. Anyways, do you know that it actually has a huge cause to it? The reason why she actually put it out? It was because she was actually in the hospital for cancer. Or no, for polio. And because she was in the hospital for polio, she was a teacher. And while she was in the hospital, she noticed that there's a lot of kids that were really struggling with being in the, in the hospital for so long. So she actually came up with designing a game to help the kids forget about their time in the hospital. And the kids loved it, absolutely loved it. So when she went out to sell it, she actually got the patent and started selling it to Milton, Bro Milton Bradley. She pitched it to them after writing a letter about her experience, I mean, it was a no brainer to buy. They were going to get not just a new game that kids would love, but they're also going to get a story, a heart wrenching story of how she helped um, cure the, the boredom of being in a hospital and the fear in the hospital with a game. And you know what? Hat tip to her. You did great, Eleanor. So, we're um, in the course, we're going to actually talk about this. We're going to talk about different things that went wrong with the game and things that went right. But besides that, um, we're also going to talk to you about how to begin your game. Okay, so two weeks ago, we talked about the end goal. How are you going to win the game? Last week, we talked about the path. This time, we're going to take you through how to begin it. And we'll walk you through the steps. You'll be able to get your game design journal. And also, we're going to start putting it together. We're going to show you how to put the game together. Again, it has to be a well thought out, well planned, well designed game because we don't want to give you the uh, ability after taking this whole course to create junk. We want you to actually have a, a viable product that you can show your friends, you can play with your friends. We're actually, gonna, I think it's a few weeks down from now, you're actually gonna be able to beta test it. Sorry, play test it with your friends. And you're gonna be able to take their critiques what they think about the game and make it even better because that's what it's about. We want to get the perfect game close to perfect, but at the end, it doesn't matter if you have the perfect game or not. If you don't let it go, you can be working on it forever to get it perfect. You need to let it go at some point. We're going to teach you about that because it's at that point that you can get a lot more feedback 
and be able to create a better game. So this is what we're doing in our game design course. Love to see you there. If you're already part of our membership, if you've already purchased a membership for Historical Conquest, you get the rare card program, you get free randomized cards, you get free other cards. We're sending you things constantly every month. And you also get our activity books. Uh, for parents, you'll love this screen-free summer. Okay, uh, those that have taken this course, I didn't say that. Don't listen to me. Not one bit. I'm not falling asleep while I'm talking to you. Not at all. I'm not tired. Anyways, hello. Okay, so we're going to let you there. Let, let you go there. I am getting really tired, so I need to go home. I'm still at the office, actually. So I'm going to go home. You guys have fun with this um, this week on YouTube. Hope you're able to join us for week seven of our game design course. Take care. Bye, guys. And girls. If you have any comments or questions, add them to the comments below. Otherwise, we'll see you next. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow, actually. Take care. Bye.